kitten. Those lovely people at Personal Impressions have sent me a jelly plate to play with and some paints. So come along with me. This is the first time I've used one of these and I can't wait to get mucky. I've collected together my supplies. I've got my jelly plate on my mat. I've got some card blanks. I've got some good old bubble wrap and some hessian and some paper for texture. I've got my brayer. I've got some Tim Holtz stencils. And I've got some Kaiser colour paint. I've never used this before. So this will be interesting. Right, fold my card blank in half. Start with some white for the background. Nice and oh, it's quite runny. Work it into the plate fairly gently. Nice, uh, spread it out. more gently because I'm getting marks in it look need to be fairly gentle obviously uh, so let's make a pattern in it Woo! and press the card blank into it interesting. Just going to clean my jelly plate off a bit and then I shall be back. That's dried really quickly. I suppose it's just a very thin layer of paint on there. So let's try blob of green. It's very runny this. Work it onto the plate. And I will use... Let's use the Hessian for texture. See what that does. And I'm just going to do a little bit there. And a little bit there. That's pretty. When I get organised, I shall clean the brayer and the thing off in my journal. But right at this moment, I'm just going to wash everything off and get back to you. Again, that's dried really quickly. So let's try it with a stencil. Oops. Very runny this paint. Which is good because you can spread it around easily and not have great big lumps in it. That's what you want for printing really. Not so hard, mustn't press hard. That's better. I'm going to put that in the middle and that on top. Press in well. Try not to wiggle it too much. It's very soft and squishy, this jelly plate. It really is like working on a piece of jelly. That's lovely. I'm going to leave it like that. Just add a few embellishments and keep it really simple and painterly. <laughs>